Welcome to Digital Asset News, the top stories in cryptocurrency and digital assets, and bring them down to bite-sized pieces. Today, we've only got two stories, and they're pretty interesting. First up, a universal basic income app launches, and it gives users free crypto. I'm excited about this one because I've always been a fan of universal basic income, so it's interesting to see that this actually comes alive on the blockchain also. This is going to be a complex story, but it's going to reveal the ridiculousness of the market. So first, we've got Aves Lend spikes by over 21% after Coinbase Custody reveals exploring the Aave token. And to reveal why this is kind of ridiculous, we need to take a hard look at what exactly Aave is. But before we do that, let's take a look at what's going on in the markets. So today, it is October 18th. It is high noon Texas time, and it looks like we've got a little bit of a rebound. So Bitcoin's up by a percent. I'm happy with that. Almost at 11.5. So, so back again after that uh, OKX debacle that is going on over there. Ethereum up 2.5%, almost back to 380. So everything looks like it's almost going back. Uh, Tether's Tether, XRP almost to its rightful place, uh, pegged to the quarter at 24 cents. Bitcoin Cash, 1.9%, one chain link up 3.6, almost $11. So just pretty much a nice little rebound and pretty much what I thought was gonna happen. So again, when we have these goofy stories where OKX does you know something ridiculous and then there's a little dip here and there, nothing changes the fundamentals don't change the cryptocurrency digital asset market nothing really happened just one goofy exchange did something stupid and it's just a, a great opportunity to just pick up a little flash sale between you know three percent to up to ten percent and here we are going right back to where we were before the okx story so if you took the advice and bought the dip congratulations to you i know i did that uh, myself but uh, we'll see what happens uh let's see where we got as far as the biggest losers uh crypto.com down nine percent uh, down 21% for the week. And I've been getting a lot of emails, direct messages on Twitter. Apparently there's something going on with rewards and staking. So I don't really get into crypto.com uh, as far as like one of the exchanges or wallets that I recommend. I just I just don't. People always send me things like, it's awesome, it's awesome. But uh, I, I don't know, I just don't get into it. And this is, I think, one of those reasons. Everybody's gonna have growing pains. Every single wallet and every single exchange is, gonna, is going to have issues. There is no perfect thing out there. And uh, when things like this happen with the rewards getting slashed, of course, you're gonna see a big tumble. Uh, EOS, Monero, everything's up 2.1%. There is a hard fork coming up for Monero, but they're not splitting. It's just a uh, upgrade. So uh, I think people are really into that. They think it might be something else, but they're, they're not going to split. It's just an upgrade for the protocol. And let's see, Cosmos up 5.5. OKB, 9.7%. Uh, That's weird. It's considering that they are the official token of OKX, but uh, yeah, sure. Uh, 2.8 for Huobi, 8.4 for VeChain. Fantastic for your VeChain holders. Hey, 7.5% up for Uniswap. It makes me happy. And then, uh, wow, 25% for UMA, another DeFi token, synthetics, 12.8 for Yearn. And what else do we have? And this is a weird one. The Ave, which we're going to talk about right now, it's uh, down 3%. Before I actually get into that, let's just go on to uh, the main story and then we'll jump into the, the Ave issue. So first up, this was pretty interesting. This was sent to me by J to the T. Thanks, J to the T. I really appreciate it. And it talks about universal basic income app launches, gives users free crypto and really free money if you look at it. Circles is a universal basic income app based on the Ethereum blockchain. If you're not really familiar with the universal basic income, it really what it states is that everybody should get a set amount uh, no matter their position, uh, no matter if they're super rich or super poor, everybody gets a, a set amount. And we actually have this uh, in the United States. In, in Alaska, they get about $1,600 annually. And all they have to really do is just be residents of Alaska. And really what it comes down to is each resident gets to uh, have a share of the uh, of the state's oil revenue because oil is heavy in Alaska. And it states, most everyone who's lived in Alaska for a year or more, just got 1,600, no strings attached. The annual giveaway shares the Arctic state's oil revenues with its residents, but Alaska's program, now in 38th year, is also providing valuable data. And it goes on to some other things. But yeah, we do have universal basic income, it's just in one state. So when I see an article here about uh, universal basic income being put on the blockchain, I'm like, hmm, tell me more. Let's see what's going on. Because everybody likes free money, but I don't really think anything's really free. So Circles is a basic income on the blockchain launched today. Here is the creator, Martin Kopelman. And he talks about how it took him seven years just to get here, which is pretty impressive. Only took him seven years. Circles, uh, which just launched on the XDAI Ethereum sidechain, gives each of its users a basic income in the form of a cryptocurrency called Circles. Value of a circle, which at present is unclear, increases as more people use the network. So 
That sounds a little bit odd right now, but uh, maybe it'll actually work out. Let's see. The protocol issues circles to all of its users each week. Upon sign up, you'll receive 100 circles. Then you'll receive about 14 each week, and the value should inflate by 7% each year. Anyone can create an account, but to verify it, you'll need three incoming trust connections. I'll get to that in a bit. This means that three people must invite you to the platform. The Berlin-based company, which launches as Germany experiences a second wave of the coronavirus pandemic. If from Germany, let me know about that because one of our renters is actually from Germany. He talks about how Germany's doing actually pretty well because they're doing contact tracing. So is that true what they're saying about? Is, that, is, is there a second wave coming about? Let me know in the comment section. So anyhow, Circles advises that you only verify other users if you know someone in person. However, many users have posted their invitation codes on Twitter so people can verify. Sure. And then of course, it took uh, seven years like we just talked about. Upon launch, its website struggled to handle the activity and its servers crashed. So let's take a look at that. Maybe we should sign up for it. So it is joincircles.net. The link will be in the description like everything else in this video. So let's see what we got. Nice little slick looking website. And here's how you do it. Uh, looks like four steps. Sign up, get trusted, receive your circles, use your circles. I like that. That seems pretty simple. Let's just uh, see how this all works out, shall we? So we're going to click on Get Circles. And it's going to take us to circles.garden. And we can log in or sign up. Since I haven't done anything, I'm going to click on Sign Up. Unconditional income. Interesting. Circles is designed to be a basic income from the bottom up. When you create a Circles account, you are unconditionally issued circles on a regular basis. So that's the whole point of UBI. So next. Well, you can spend circles with people you trust and the people they trust only, it looks like. And you can build your own economy. Huh? Circles has no central leadership, so it's yours to create. You can invite friends and local businesses to circles to support and create an alternative economy. So it looks like you are building this yourself. So when we talk about uh, why does the dollar have value, why does this have value, it's because we give it value. And that's looks like that's exactly what circles is all about. So let's find it. Got it. Create your username. I'm going to go with digital asset news let's see if anybody's taking it oh look at that no one's taking it amazing continue enter email well that's pretty simple dan and continue so here's our seed phrase i'm going to write this down in my stone book did you save your seed phrase please enter word two in your seed phrase sure oh great now you can your photo your photo is how your friends can search for you in the circles app well and there we are so sign me up all right your account is successfully created. Uh, now we need to verify my account. How do you do that? To receive your basic income, three people must trust your profile. So looks like three have to actually know me who are in this whole thing. So share the profile link. Let me click on that. And I think what I will do is put this on Twitter like everybody else. So let me tweet something. So I'm gonna say, checking out this universal basic income for the blockchain. If you know what this is about, help me get verified. And I'll put the profile right there. And let's tweet that out. All right, so that's it. So let's see how that works out. But uh, it's an interesting concept. Again, I don't know if uh, circles will be worth anything at any point, but uh, universal basic income uh, seems to work in other places. So maybe it'll work on the blockchain. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Let's move on.